Tesla Cybertruck has been seen carrying a rocket engine. In today's video, we have some really exciting news to share about the Tesla Cybertruck and how it's already being put to use by SpaceX down at their Starbase facility in Boca Chica, Texas. We'll take a look at some recent footage showing the Cybertruck towing around a massive rocket part like it's nothing. We'll also discuss the Starlink satellite dish equipped on top of the truck and what implications that could have for disrupting the internet industry, similar to how Tesla is disrupting cars. There's a lot of interesting stuff to unpack here, so let's get right into it. Cybertruck Towing Starship Engine Let's focus in on the most jaw-dropping element spotted in this new footage. The Cybertruck casually towing around a completed Raptor rocket engine from SpaceX's Starship program. Now to truly appreciate why this is so mind-blowing, let us highlight some specs around the Raptor propulsion system and the sheer scale of these components. Each Raptor engine generates nearly a quarter million pounds of thrust at full power. That's equivalent to the exertion of over 75 Boeing 747 jetliners. The specific version equipped on Starship optimized for operating in a vacuum puts out even more brute force since it's designed for extremely high altitude and outer space use cases. And when fully fueled these are not lightweight toys. A single installed flight Raptor tips the scales at around 15 metric tons or 35,000 pounds. Let's put that extraordinary weight into perspective. That's nearly triple what a Ford F-150 can tow. And the curb weight by itself rivals an entire 18-wheeler tractor-trailer rig loaded with 40 tons of cargo. So surely the Cybertruck can't actually be rated to haul anywhere close to 35,000 pounds right. While checking Tesla's official specs, the maximum tow rating across all models peaks at just 14,000 pounds, which sounds high already. Until you consider this Raptor engine nearly triples that mediocre tow rating. Clearly the real-world capacity far exceeds what Tesla can advertise, and Elon himself has explained the published tau figures, had to be extremely conservative to ever achieve regulatory approval and qualification. But while other automakers sandbag performance metrics, Tesla seems to drastically underpromise. If it can safely tow three times the rated capacity while handling like cargo weight, imagine what the true maximum at low speed could be. The implications here are just astounding. No other electric truck comes even remotely close to matching this power and torque output, and only the very highest end diesel trucks could likely move this much load. It's just an unbelievable demo of the incredible capabilities Tesla has achieved, towing 15 tons like it's nothing, while the Raptor itself generates over 75 tons of raw thrust, an EV pickup truck hauling a rocket ship engine. The Cybertruck executing a full 6G turn would probably drag that giant Raptor bell nozzle right through the dirt. What an insane showcase of torque. Starlink Internet Dish Now, clearly the Cybertruck towing a 15-ton rocket engine is impressive enough. But check out the other cutting-edge SpaceX technology integrated on top of this prototype, what seems to be a permanently mounted Starlink terminal. For those unfamiliar with Starlink, it's SpaceX's own network of over 4,500 low-orbit satellites continuously growing. The goal is to provide high speed low-latency broadband internet access anywhere on the planet. By transmitting data straight from their orbital satellites instead of through land-based infrastructure, the network works remarkably well even in rural and remote regions lacking traditional connectivity. The service rivals and even surpasses cable or fiber optic internet speeds in many areas thanks to the unique architecture and extensive coverage footprint from space. For consumers, Starlink aims to offer a viable home internet solution for overlooked regions where fiber or cable internet hasn't reached. No other provider can realistically support decent infrastructure for sparsely populated areas. But Starlink also offers an RV package with a mobile roof-mounted phased array antenna. It allows vehicles like boats, RVs, and even trucks to have reliable internet access continuously on the move. That's exactly the kind of terminal we see mounted on this SpaceX Cybertruck prototype. Having constant high bandwidth connectivity unlocks all sorts of critical capabilities for modern utility vehicles. Of course, internet access enables productivity, navigation, entertainment, and communication. But high-throughput satellite networks layered with edge computing open up possibilities like self-driving data centers and connected freight hauling and SpaceX on fooding their own hardware and services accelerates improvement through extensive real-world testing. 
With enough satellites and ground links layered in, virtually flawless uptime becomes realistic even in extremely remote regions. The synergy of combining fast electric drivetrains with space-based communications could transform entire industries. Exciting to imagine what innovations might emerge from trucks, ships, and aircraft linked to orbital satellite networks. Implications for Internet Disruption Essentially, SpaceX is eating their own dog food or drinking their own champagne in this case. By leveraging two of their own potentially revolutionary products together, Starlink and the Cybertruck, they can streamline operations and reduce reliance on third-party technology and infrastructure. Think about it. Why would SpaceX bother installing a dish from some other internet provider if they have confidence in continuous uptime and bandwidth from their own satellite network? This actually perfectly mirrors the early days of Tesla, when the company built out an entire nationwide network of their own superchargers rather than relying on third-party charging networks. It was a huge upfront investment, but the control and reliability ultimately positioned them far ahead of the competition. And Starlink has similar potential to achieve dominance in the internet services market by offering superior connectivity compared to terrestrial providers, especially for locations outside major urban centers. We could very well see a future in the coming years where Starlink captures a major share of the global residential and mobile internet industry. And having SpaceX dog food Starlink internet via products like the Cybertruck will only accelerate its improvement. The synergy here is really exciting. Tesla's electric vehicles paired with SpaceX's satellite internet could enable all kinds of revolutionary use cases and business models. Definitely something to keep a close eye on as both products mature and scale up. Potential use cases. The Cybertruck and Starlink combo opens up many exciting use cases for commercial and industrial applications. Construction sites could benefit greatly from the setup with the Cybertruck, providing a rugged, durable work truck, while Starlink enables high-speed connectivity for remote project coordination, file sharing, video calls, etc. Additionally, first responder Cybertrucks would have reliable communications in disaster zones through the satellite network allowing better emergency coordination. Military operations also stand to gain from the pairing, with Starlink offering secure encrypted internet for defense forces, paired with the Cybertruck's armored body and off-road handling to access difficult environments. Furthermore, industries like mining, drilling, and exploration operating in remote areas could leverage the continuous connectivity the Starlink and Cybertruck package provides. Even power grid management could be optimized with smart Cybertrucks utilizing Starlink bandwidth and onboard computing for mobile data analysis to improve energy distribution across infrastructure. Autonomous Capabilities The Cybertruck architecture is designed for advanced autonomy. With integrated cameras, sensors, and computing power built into the platform, there is strong support for sophisticated self-driving features. Additionally, constant Starlink connectivity enables continuous real-time data exchanges with the vehicle fleet and cloud computing resources in order to coordinate advanced navigation lacking with autonomous platforms currently. This sets the stage for applications such as autonomous Cybertruck convoys transporting cargo cross-country, which could transform shipping and logistics by drastically lowering operating costs. Cybertruck Production Ramp Updates from Gigafactory Texas highlight how manufacturing scale continues expanding rapidly to match the enormous demand the Cybertruck has generated. The gigantic factory houses parts production, body assembly and general vehicle assembly, all streamlining vertical integration. Currently, Gigatexas targets building 500,000 vehicles annually, including the Cybertruck. So in closing, we think we're getting some fantastic glimpses here at the future to come with both the Cybertruck and Starlink satellite internet. Seeing SpaceX already test and prove out real-world applications by leveraging the synergies between both companies is awesome. Let us know your thoughts on SpaceX using the Cybertruck like this in a mobile utility role at Starbase. Do you think we'll see large commercial fleets adopting Cybertrucks in the coming years, paired with Starlink networks? As always, love to have that discussion with you guys down in the comments below.